Title, Power Combo Unstoppable? Microsoft Activision merger survives legal boss battle. TLDR, a judge threw a monkey wrench into the FTC's game plan, denying their injunction request to halt Microsoft's titanic takeover of Activision. The plot thickens as this mega merger creeps one step closer to a completed side quest. Can anyone hit the pause button now? Microsoft's beast mode seems to be unstoppable. After a round of legal fisticuffs, it appears their audacious alliance with gaming titan Activision is on the fast track. But what's the end game, and who's holding the cheat codes? The courtroom drama reached a climax when the judge delivered a real shocker, denying the FTC's, Federal Trade Commission, request for an injunction. In gaming lingo, it's like a powerful boss suddenly took a critical hit. This new scent waves through the digital realm, leaving everyone asking, what does this mean for the gaming world? and are we just bystanders in this mega-corporate co-op mission? The FTC, in their noble quest to protect consumer rights and maintain competitive landscapes, sought to put the brakes on this epic merger. They worry it might create an imbalance, spawning a gaming Godzilla with too much power. But the court saw things differently and decided to let the game play on. But with this mega-merger now seemingly inevitable, what's next for the industry? Gamers, developers, and even the FTC are left scratching their heads wondering if they should grab some popcorn or gear up for another round of battle. Let's take a step back and understand what this union means. Microsoft, a software kingpin, merging with ActiveIcon, an entertainment behemoth, could be the most epic crossover event since Avengers, Endgame. It's like Master Chief and Call of Duty's Captain Price joining forces to redefine the gaming landscape. But is this a power-up or a potential glitch in the Matrix? It's clear that this merger will change the gaming landscape. What's uncertain is how. Could it lead to a monopoly, stifling competition, and driving up prices? Or will it usher in a golden age of gaming, redefining what's possible in this interactive universe? More importantly, who gets to decide, the corporations or the gamers? But let's not forget the human element. With Microsoft planning to assimilate Activision's workforce, one can't help but wonder how the employees feel. Excited for the future? Or anxious about becoming small pixels in a vast digital empire? We're at a crossroads, folks. On one side, we have a potentially industry-defining partnership, and on the other, fears of unchecked corporate power. It's like standing at the edge of a cliff in a game, wondering whether to take the leap or step back. This tale is far from over. But for now, the game continues, with players around the world watching closely, controllers in hand, ready for whatever the next level brings. What do you think, dear readers? Are you ready to roll the dice and see where this Microsoft Activision merger leads, or should we hit the emergency break before it's too late? Disclaimer, the opinions expressed in this article are solely those of the author and do not constitute investment advice. Always do your own research before making any investment decisions. So, I ask you, are we ready for this change? Or should we be questioning the power dynamic in the digital realm? What are your thoughts on this mega deal? Should the FTC have won this round or is this progression inevitable and ultimately beneficial? Let's spark up some fiery debates.